Hi guys, today's topic is the conditionals. We have three conditionals plus the zero conditional, which is not a conditional itself, um, because it refers to general truth. So here we have, if it rains, the streets get wet. I choose present in the condition clause and present in the consequence clause. Conditional first is called the present real conditional. Real because something will happen in the future if a condition happens at present. So I use present in the condition clause and future in the consequence clause. Conditional two or the second conditional is called the present unreal conditional because even though the, pre the verb in the condition clause is in past, it refers to the present. If I had a time machine, it means that I don't have a time machine, I could travel back in time, which is something that I can't do because I don't have a time machine. I use a modal and a verb in the present tense. This is unreal and the meaning is just the opposite. If I had a time machine means I don't have a time machine, we can see the relation and we can see also that this clause is referred to the present. I could travel back in time. It means that I can't travel back in time since I don't have a time machine. The third conditional refers to the past and it's also unreal. That's why though it's also called the past unreal conditional. If you had been alive 50 years ago, your life would have been different. <clears throat> Uh, I use the past perfect here, but the meaning is past, and I use the modal good plus the present perfect to refer to the past too. So I say, if you had been alive, it means that you weren't alive 50 years ago, your life would have been different. It means your life was not different. So, one more time, conditional zero, I use present in the condition clause and present in the consequence clause. Conditional first, I use present in the, con in the condition clause, future in the consequence clause. Second conditional, I use past in the, co in the condition clause, modal plus present in the consequence clause. And finally, the third conditional, I use the past perfect in the condition clause, and modal plus present perfect in the consequence clause. Brought to you by Luis Mendoza.